everyone. Welcome back to Animal Crossing. City Folk. Day 19. In the evening. Yeah, let's get started. Who am I? I'm King. Oh, only joking. You, of course you wouldn't forget. <laughs> oh, Rover. <sighs> good, good, good jokes. Boy, that never gets old. So. Okay, so, ooh, so we have some mail. It's also evening. <gasps> yeah, we got three letters, because we sent three. Okay, here's what's going on. We are going to water all of our stuff. Oh, we might do fishing, I don't know. I don't know. Water some things. We're gonna go to town. This lovely, clear evening. So I sold a bunch of just like peaches and uh, seashells, lots of seashells. Um, none of that was particularly eventful. While I was doing that, as we'll see in a moment when I open my inventory after we finish watering all the flowers, uh, while I was doing all that, uh, a present appeared, so I shot that out of the sky. Uh, Spork just went, oh, and walked up to me and said, here, take this, don't ask any questions, and handed me something, I forget what it was, like a, another wallpaper or something? I don't even know. I don't even know. Uh, I haven't even looked at that. And then, uh, just like, as I was running back and forth, I found two orchid mantises. I actually found a third, but I was sprinting like an idiot. Oh, speaking of being an idiot, uh, I was sprinting like an idiot, so it, I didn't... I didn't get that third one. But, you know, two is still pretty good. And so all of that stuff is still just in my inventory. I didn't, I couldn't be bothered to deal with it. <laughs> I just wanted to sell my dumb shells. That was on my last run. And I was like, all right, we'll just deal with it later. Anyway. So yeah, we got an extra feral chunk of money. And yeah, all of the seashells and all of the peaches that I was selling as I was running back and forth netted me, like... Maybe a thousand bells, eleven hundred, something like that. It was not much. Oh, actually, that's a lie. It was mostly not much, and then right at the very end, there was a piece of coral that showed up. And the coral's worth a fair bit. I'm just gonna water some of these. We should go back and talk to Agent S. Agent S. And I saw static running around, too. Just a moment ago. Should we just water like every flower? Maybe we should just water like every flower. There we go. Okay, what what we got kicking around here? Let's check the inventory. Oh yeah, orchid. Oh yeah, I didn't sell the coral. Just kidding. Oh. <laughs> he gave us a second library wall. Alright, well. Thanks again, Spork, for another one. Oh, we got a mama bear. Okay. Interesting stuff. Okay, we're doing our super quick search for fossils. I'm saying super quick because I'm incredibly optimistic. Oh yeah, also we should really just be hitting the money rock every, hitting every rock we can looking for the money rock. However words are supposed to work. <gasps> Pill bug! Wait. 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 No, I'm so bad at using the bug net. Catch it. It's not even moving. Catch it. There we go. I caught a pill bug. Why don't you chill, bug? Wow, and that's another piece of coral? That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Okay, we should sell our shells more often. Yeah, white scallops worth a bit. I think the corals were- Hey! Our water friend is back. Are there any- Oh man, we should check for more shells. Our tree is growing. That's so cool. We're gonna have coconuts soon. Bell's top. Sorry, we're gonna check something real quick. I don't think I- Ooh, that was a big old fish out of there too. Oh my gosh, there's so many things I want to do. I'm so easily distracted. Stay on task. Checking, what was this? Did I, did we look at this? 
scalp. I think that's what we want. If not, we can always sell it. Yeah, sure, another white scallop. Hang on a second, my pockets are full. We're not gonna ditch the pill bug. Um, we'll come back for the coral. We'll just load up on scallops. What was this? Not a scallop. Venus gum. Okay. I talk to our otter friend. Hello, otter friend. Oh, there's a blue butterfly we probably could catch and is probably worth something. How are you doing, buddy? It's Pascal. Gonna wait for the bells while I talk. I don't have to. I won't have to try to talk over the bells. Oh, that is exactly what I was doing for a while. Oh, man! Standing is so tiring. Hey, can I share a little something with you? Uh, sure. Okay. Why do we call money bells, man? That's crazy! Dude, you just blew my mind. Hey, hook an otter up with a scallop, would you, man? Yeah, okay, he does want a scallop. I remember this vaguely. First time we talked to him. Look, man, this here, I'm gonna do it to you! He's a... Just... Super chill, hippie otter dude. Bye, Pascal. I'll miss you. So what did we get from him? Also, what did I do with this? We're not going to be able to get any fossils because my inventory is full. Let's pick up the coral. Let's go sell stuff. Let's go pay a visit to Nook. Right, just kidding. <clears throat> now we're going to go pay a visit to Nook. Oh, they're static. Static, I want to come back and talk to you. Don't go anywhere. care of our town. Gotta make sure all of our flowers are looking fantastic. Oh no, the tulips are dying too. Oh jeez. So many flowers. Luckily Nooks is open late. Okay, we're gonna sell a bunch of stuff. Let's see what we got. Um, we already have a library wall. I don't need another one. Coral, yes. Orchid mantises, yes. White scallops, yes. Pillbug, no, that's going into the museum. A helm. And a mama bear. I don't know what those look like, so let's go see what they look like before we commit. 6870, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Oh, of course, always take flowers. Is that a lucky cat? That is a lucky cat! I have to have it. I have to have it. It is quite a bargain, yes. Must, needs. I have to have it. Okay, backyard fence. That's, that's something. That's something you could have inside your house. That's not too terrible. In my humble opinion. We are gonna go into the city here in just a minute. I really wanna do that. I'm gonna go swing by Reds and see if he has any crazy fake art to sell us. Or real art, that would be ideal. As unlikely as that seems. So many tools. Cool, so there's one. Other fossils. Um, the fossils aren't going anywhere. Stuff in the city might close if I dirtle around for too long. I don't know. We should do some, like, nighttime fishing. Whoa. Right where the clock is, there's a big old bug. Yeah. Super huge mothy boy. We were coming with. Silk moth. Pretty or pretty hideous? 
Well, trick question because all bugs are hideous. And that's just a common cricket? Yeah. You've certainly run into plenty of those. They're all over the place. In fact, you're, I don't even think you're worth selling. Cricket, get out of here. Into the water. He drowned. He just got eaten by a fish. I am not even sorry. One less wretched, hideous monstrosity in the world. Okay. Hello, Blathers! I don't think I've donated a oak silk moth before. Leave the beast caged! Yes, they are revolting. While the oak silk moth has impressively large wings, it is said that this moth isn't a very skilled flyer. I should think that might be the reason it's developed such big, vulgar eyeballs. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we have a pill bug. And when they're all rolled up in a ball, pill bugs seem harmless enough, but flip them over and oh, those legs! Absolutely repugnant. Thinking about how they wriggle and squirm as my feathers crawling. <laughs> All right, have a good night, Blathers. We'll be back in a bit when we have some more fossils. So... That was cool. I was not expecting to bump into an oak silk moth. I haven't... We haven't done a lot of... We've done a little bit. We haven't done a lot of, like, nighttime stuff. There's plenty of different fish that only come out at night or really early in the morning bugs also that should be fairly apparent by judging by the uh, oak silk moth we just saw Woohoo, king oh hey king did you know you can earn some serious bells selling fossils in this town when i'm like desperate to buy something it's a good way to get some scratch together this may look like i'm just walking around but nope i'm looking for fossils okay well good luck may the best squirrel win and that is that is me i'm sorry i will get all the fossils you are not allowed to have any let me get three, and then you can have whatever's left. We haven't done this yet. In all of the Animal Crossing stuff, I keep meaning to do this, but we haven't done this. We haven't come in here and talked to the guards. So, Booker and Copper. Welcome to the checkpoint for bustling at Leah Fall. Listen well, when you want to visit another town, or if perhaps you have a friend come visit you here, come let me know in advance. I insist! You see, armed with that information, I can open this gate for you. Uh, so, this is, this is co-op. This is, you know... T t doesn't really happen now that we Nintendo we is just offline. The servers are down, but um, this is where you do co-op. Co-op. Get your friend codes. So you can invite people to your town. Give enter friend codes to go to other people's towns. That sort of thing. You, on the other hand, oh, um, yeah. Hi. So, uh, uh, what what can what can I do for you? Um, I don't think there's anything in Lost and Found, but we'll check. <laughs> Oh, you do? Ten! Pad paper, a mini lamp, a zipper shirt, an airy shirt, and a crossing shirt. Why do you have all these things and then the pitfall seats? This is for like if the game tries to generate an item and it can't put it in a spot, like if it's putting a, a pitfall seed or a, a fossil down or something. Um. We're getting a little technical and a little meta and a little out of the game here, but it's also for if, like, the game plants a fossil and then somebody moves into town and they build their house where that fossil was, or the pitfall seed or whatever. Those get, those get ejected. Because there's a house there now, the game has to do something with them. And they go here and lost and found. So this is weird. We have a mini lamp, I don't really need one of those. Uh, paper I don't really care for. Shirts, I don't really care either, but it's just interesting that there's stuff here. Oh, yeah. Sorry, none of it, <clears throat> none of it was mine. It's not what I lost. What else you got, Booker? Um, this is where we could change our flag. Maybe let's just say, hey, what's going on? What's new? What's what's the haps? Oh, I I didn't I didn't notice anyone go through here. So he'll observe if like Joan or Sahara or somebody is in town and they arrived through the gate. So we can talk to him and see if there are NPCs in town that I've not been able to find. 
but I also just run around town a lot, so this is really interesting. Anyway, the last thing we can do is change our flag! Please, take your time. Yeah. We changed our flag, it is now Rover. I could have swapped and taken that design back that was on the flag originally. Maybe I should have done that. Yay, it's Rober! We should color his face in. That's kind of the whole point, but I'm not gonna do that now. Let's go to the city. We'll come back and look for the fossils and stuff in a bit, but I just wanna go to the city. Let's go to the city. Let's go to the city. I wanna talk to Captain. He's gonna give me some weird life advice or something. He told me to say yar at some pretty lasses in the city and maybe walk a gangplank and hoist a mutiny for some rum. I don't know. This is Captain. He's just a pirate bus driver. I got to say, Sprat. You look mighty young. Are you a student, perhaps? Yar, har, 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 har! Har to be young again. Something. Whoops, didn't see that. We get the short end, matey. Lasses get ever more lovely as they age, but we lads get crustier. Anyhow, here be the city. You got all your affairs in order there? Then off with thee. Me we Gobi. Remember, the city ain't just for buying stuff, it be for making memories. He said something about treasure in there, but I skipped that on accident. My bad, I'm sorry. Look at that little sliver of a moon right there. That's cool. I'm enjoying the music, too. It's got kind of a spooky vibe to it. Oh, should we get our shoes shined? We could. Okay, a thing I need to keep my eyes peeled for whenever we come to the city. We might come to the city more often to check this. Uh, if these cones ever move, we want to go in there. If any of that stuff ever gets scooted out of the way. Let's go have our fortune tell. Let's go see if we're going to have good luck. We didn't find the money rock yet today, did we? I do not believe we have. I can unravel the threads of destiny that surround you. Coax the happiness within you to bloom. I don't know the difference between getting a charm or having my fortune told. I don't know what any of these things do. Let's get a charm. Now I'll tell you how to bring more happiness to those around you. Please don't hit me in the head. Oh, dang it. I spoke too late. Him, I see it. Wait, right, that right there when she says, oh, I see it. It reminds me of uh, the, the Katamari. Oh, I feel it. I feel the cosmos, the little girl. Anyway, I have revealed for you a hidden charm that helps you obtain ancient rewards. Yes, you must plant trees in Leofall. A total of three. This is Leah Falls' September charm. Ooh. Too bad September is, uh... September's almost over, so that doesn't really matter. However, it will have no effect if you perform this charm. It must be performed by a visitor from another town. And it may be that only they reap the charm's reward. Well, that's... Lame. Okay, so we cannot get a fortune told today. <sighs> or we cannot get a fortune told on top of getting a charm. Oh, I want to get in there. Can I just move the cones? Can I just push them? I'm strong. I'm not stronger than those cones. Those are huge, by the way, if they're like as tall as me. Man. Oh, I heard a rumor there's a waiting room above the theater for performers. Woof. Woof. That's cool. We know that Gracie Grace is only going to change when the season changes. And I think I think the autumn season stuff just started, so I don't think we're going to change again until, like, I don't know, end of November or something. You have a safe and a bed again. Red, you have the weirdest things here. Well, if it ain't our favorite cousin already, welcome to you, King. Gotta tell you, cousin, Red's always astounded at how you can sniff out a bargain. That regal bed is offered through my shop only. No raccoon with an apron's gonna have this. I should hope not. And it's such a rare item! Why, I can count the number of these in the world on one paw. 
And who would think I could part with it for only 6,240 bells? That's just how we treat our cousins. No, thanks. Sorry. Who in the heck? Listen, cousin, wouldn't you rather regret buying it than regret not regretting it? I'd rather just not have any regret at all. Uh, we're not going to get this the safe, but let's see if we can get some art. Ho ho, cousin, I'm so glad someone with an artist's eye finally stepped into my humble shop. I fell in love with that nice painting the first time I ever laid my eyes on it. I had to beg and plead with the previous owner to sell. You said this about the last painting you sold me, too. Old Reb was on his paws and knees for that one. If I had my druthers, I'd like to keep it around forever. But if my number one best cousin wants it, then I guess we'd part with it for about 4K. Jeez, that's expensive. All right, sure, I'll take an art. One art, please. Just had a bit of a Zoidberg moment. Okay. How's that referral business coming along? Crazy Reds isn't advertised yet. No, 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 no. I don't. No, 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 no. Ugh. <sighs> we, don't, we don't need more invitations. I don't care. I'm not going to sell them. Sorry, Red. It's probably not going to get sold. Sent. Or sold. Or anything. Um, I don't think there's an auction going on right now. I don't even know what day it is. September 28th? Is that tomorrow or the day after? It's one of those two things. It's the same day that Nook has his uh, point bonus thing. Let's pop into the Happy House Academy and see if it's still my weird gyroid nest. Please be something different. Please don't just be my... Oh, dang it. Oh, that's from before we rearranged it and had the, the new ones added. Gyroids are worth a ton of points, and I think the, uh... I think the Mario-themed stuff is also worth a ton of points. That's alright. Whatever. Whatever. Doesn't matter. How weird that just... <laughs> my... my yeah, haphazard mishmash of gyroids wins quite regularly. Okay, well that was kind of actually... Wait. Did we ever buy... I'm tempted to get the red argyle top. I love how whimsical it is. How much is it? We have all season to come back and get it, so uh, but I'm I might I'm really tempted to get that red argyle top. I like it. I like it. But I also really like being a witch. Can't like throw coins into the lucky founder or anything. Have our day. We'll be able to do something fountainy eventually. Maybe. Depending on if I could ever pay off my stupid house. Whew. And on that note, we gotta go find our money rock. <laughs> you are there, me wee clam. Aren't ye a dapper lad? Har har har. A young sprat looking as ye do. Ye must be setting your troll lines for a fine city lass. Ye best fish smart, lad. City girls be a fine sight for the eyes, to be sure, but you're a country lad, yar. Ye gots to be sure a lass won't run for the hills when she sees that drafty tree fort ye be living in. It's not drafty, it's just a fun fungusy. It's fungal. It's got a, a, an earthy charm to it. Or maybe ye got a country estate? What do I know? I'll leave ye... I'll leave ye be for the rest of the trip. <laughs> what do I know? I'm a bit of an idiot. Don't listen to me. I'm gonna be done talking to you for the rest of the trip. I mean, I would be doing that, but we just reached your town. You think on what I told you, though, yar? Yar. No, oh, Captain. Yay! I don't know if I like the rover flag there. I might just need to design a pattern. We also need to change our town music to. I'm gonna. I'm gonna work on that. I'm gonna. We're gonna come up with something good. I'm gonna come up with something good. I'm just gonna have to do that. K 
Okay, let's go hit rocks with our shovel. Wait, is that a mosquito? Wait, 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 are you a mosquito? Yeah! It's like a tiny vampire. Except hideous and disgusting. Everybody loves vampires. Nobody could ever love a mosquito. They're terrible. Wretched, wretched, hideous nightmare fuel. Static, how you doing? You're still here in town, though, aren't you? Now, King, what's going on with you? Oh, yeah, you wanted a shark to Oh, it's sad to think that you and I won't get to shoot the breeze like this anymore once I'm gone. Oh, don't go. <sighs> Glad to know you'll miss me, King, but I gotta live life by my own rules, you know? You know, I'm not gonna vanish this instant. I'm just letting you know I'm not long for this town. So you and I better find some time to goof off together before I go, sidekick. Oh, static. I'm gonna miss your grumpy old man face. Looking for fossils and money rock. And also any like really cool bugs or come on, there we go. Or Flowers that need to be watered that I have missed. Did we buy Nook's flowers? We did. Yeah, I don't. We'll maybe just sell that or something. I don't know. We'll plant one more there. It's lovely. And whose is this? Bob's. Bob, you can have a flower too. Helm, Mama Bear. Lucky cat. Oh, we got so many things. And here, I'll even water your flower that I just gave you, Bob. You're welcome. I'm gonna go see what all of the new furniture looks like. Let's see if I want to keep any of it for when we expand the house, or even for now. That lucky cat, I kind of want to make room for. Let's see if it's stuff we want to sell. Make an extra little bit of money. I think we're gonna do a bit of fishing, hopefully. Sorry, excuse me, kit. Uh, okay, fine, what? Hey, King, you have any interest in this striped cone? I'm trying to clean my place up a little bit. Looking to get rid of it, if you want it. How does a bit of money sound? No, sorry. No thanks. Really, child? Is it not your sort of thing? Well, I guess I'll ask the others. Yeah, I didn't hurt your feelings by saying no. Yeah, that's fossil number two for the day. Only one more to find. It is late. Oh yeah, part of why we're, we, we went to the city so late, I knew I was gonna go to the city today. Um, part of why we went so late is because the orange traffic cones that I wanted to see moved. Oh, oh no. Um, only can be moved in the evening after like 8 p.m. or something. So we'll probably add that into our uh, weekly rotation checking on Saturdays after the concert. Okay, we're gonna read our letters that we got. I remember that our tree is coming along quite nicely. I'm excited. I want it to grow. It's just going to take a while though, isn't it? Like so. Just water a whole bunch of flowers while we're doing this. Water like several feet away from the flower. Okay, I think we got all the flowers. I don't know if the dandelions actually count as weeds. Like, should we be leaving those there? Should we be ripping them up? I'm uncertain. 
we're just gonna get rid of him. Because of my uncertainty, we're just gonna ditch him. It'll be fine. Nook will buy anything. These ones too. Fossil. I think we already watered those, right? This last fossil is just hiding from me. We will never find it. It's gonna be that one. It's gonna do that again. How you doing, Bob? Can I give you a flower? No. It's the perfect weather for chilling outside. What are you up to? Oh, just that thing. Oh yeah, that thing. Oh, <laughs> okay. That was it. Are you enjoying that thing? Sure. Yeah, I think that thing is hunting for fossils. And I'm not so much enjoying it as wishing it were already done and that I had all the fossils. <gasps> I hear present. Drifting the other way. Good. Phew. It's always a little dicey when they're so close to the edge. Where are you at present? I shall shoot you. No, go back. There we go. No. Slingshot. There we go. Haha. My present. Presents for me. Oh, you shouldn't have. Right, and my pockets full. Alright, Nook! Buy all my crap. Ooh, wait. Ha! Fossil. We'll come back for it. Inventory is full. Nice. All three fossils. So this, then blathers, then honestly probably just right on back to Nook's to <laughs> sell our <laughs> duplicate fossils if we have any. This feels good. Just gonna get rid of the invite card. Nope, keep the mosquito. Oh, right. Still gotta see about those things. <laughs> 90 bells. Alright. Well, fine. Oh, not worth it. Okay, we got oh, just so many so many things. There's so many things I gotta do. We got presents. We gotta read some letters. We got um, other presents. Let's deal with the fossil that was over here before I forget. <laughs> Let's pop into the house and check out what our furniture looks like. Oh no, don't, oh jeez, don't run through the flowers, that's terrible. I don't want to ruin our lovely little flower garden that we got going on here. I'm so happy with the gyroids. Okay, I don't know how big these things are and this is like a two by two space we have in front of us so we can see. Nice painting I'm not gonna worry about, Lucky Cat. Honestly, you should probably go in here somewhere. I don't know if the lucky cat is a feng shui sort of thing. It might be. Sometimes there's items like that that will just affect your luck in a positive sort of way. You have a mama bear. Eh. You could probably do without the mama bear. Helm. Oh, I didn't know if it was going to be like a... I guess that makes sense because it's the seafaring otter weirdo, Pascal. I didn't know if it was going to be like a helmet. Or what. But I guess a ship's helm is actually pretty cool. We'll put it over here just in case anybody wants to like pilot the room. That's the sort of thing I want to keep. So many gyroids. What is this? Oh, bear, don't care. We'll deal with the arts. Desert cactus. Huh. 
Well, lucky us, we got us a uh, cactus. Put it right there between our two bonsais. I'd love to have like tables and things to, like put the bonsais on top of, but we just we don't we've gotten we have one thing that we can put other stuff on top of, and it's currently got a lamp on top of it. It's a nasty old cardboard box. Our house is just so full of random junk. Okay. Lathers. Oh no! I, oh, I didn't mean to pick up the bonsai. Okay. Man, we gotta get some money. We gotta upgrade our room. We gotta we get more space to put stuff. We're gonna move some of those gyroids out of there. Free up a little bit of space. Get some furniture. Start theming the room a little bit. Make it more cohesive than just musical mushrooms. Musical mushrooms and some Mario stuff. Here, Blathers, we got three fossils for you to check. If one of them's a shark tooth, we owe it to somebody static, I think. Dimetrodon tail! Which we've already given you one of. Nice. That is just straight up cash money. Seismo hip, which I think we've also already turned in. Cool. I wonder if seismodon parts are worth a lot. I don't know. Sabertooth skull. Also, we have it. Look at that. So we're yeah, we're we're kind of at the tipping point where we have turned in so many fossils. Oh wait, oh dang, I meant to give you the mosquito. Here, have a tiny vampire. Except not a not a good type of tiny vampire. It's a it's a gross, disgusting one. Oh, and an art. Oh, okay, we'll take the mosquito first. The art's probably gonna be a disappointing fake. We'll save that for last. Who, yes, are you aware that mosquitoes serve as a vital source of information for the academic world? Indeed, many germs live inside of mosquitoes and use them to travel across the entire globe. By understanding the living hosts to these germs, scientists may develop new treatments. Hey, what? Blah, enough I say. We shall never to keep this wretch safe and happy. Well, hooty hoo to you too. Here, have a nice painting. I hope it's actually a, a real nice painting. Doesn't have to be real nice. It just needs to be real. And it needs to be the nice painting. How splendid! I finally see the true glory that makes passerby cry out. Oh, what a nice painting. It was real. Look at that. We're so lucky. We've bought two whole arts and they've both been genuine. Two genuine arts. That's pretty cool. So we still need the Triceratops. We have the whole Velociraptor. We need the Stego Skull. Just want to poke, poke in here and see. Yeah, we're missing a bunch there. We're missing almost all of you. Yeah, we, we still got plenty of fossils that have not been turned in, but we definitely have more than half. The Styracosaur. Look at that thing's head. Look at that skull. I mean, I guess it's trying to fend off the T-Rex that's trying to jump into it. Big old spiky skull. Oh, look at the derpy fishosaur. The ichthyosaur. Yeah, we got some good ones. I'm so happy that we have a full, complete T Rex. Alright, well, we're gonna go sell a bunch of stuff back at Nooks. Dude, I cannot get over the fact that we have gotten two genuine non forged paintings in a row. That's pretty cool. We're also going to figure out when Red's shop resets. How you doing, Kit? Oh, yeah, you wanted the thing. Sorry. Ah, you know, these lazy days are actually pretty fun. They're nice and everything, but having a special event every day wears me out. So it's good to appreciate times where you've got nowhere to be and nothing to do, child. I agree. I could not agree anymore. Man, I wanted to do some late night fishing. Let's just catch a couple of fish real quick. We also, 
I probably should swing by the Abel Sisters and see if they have whatever it was that you were asking for, kid, but... I mostly want to see if there's any cool night fish. We should be fishing in the ocean because... I... we're missing a lot of the ocean fish. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, don't go into the bridge. Phew, good. Yay, it's the rare nighttime fish known as the salmon. <sighs> Got so many of those dumb things. Is there anything interesting kicking around here? Nah, you're probably just a salmon. Oh, you were a big one. I shouldn't have run. That was, that was my bad. Okay, I think we're just going to go down to the ocean and do a little bit of fishing down there real quick. almost certainly a salmon. Anything right around here? Any cool bugs? You're an itty bitty fish. Let's catch you. Are you going to be like a goldfish or something again? Yay, you are. Her. Good weather is all this guy needs to be happy. Sometimes I like to stroll around here because there aren't many buildings in my way. You can find all sorts of neat things in places like this, like pretty fossils, spiders that look like cotton candy, how disgusting, or pretty flowers, or bells that people have to drop while strolling around, haha. -ha. Yeah, that was just once, and I came back to pick those up. Did we find our money rock? We didn't. I need to go look for that. I, you guys have seen me do that a bunch. You don't have to watch me do that. I can go do that on my own. Let's catch an ocean fish and then call it quits. There's one. Yeah, you see that. Oh, geez. I was not ready for you to go bite it on the first attack. Okay. Ah, uh, reflexes. I wish I had them. Yeah, you coming in? Are you hungry? Yeah. Ooh, we got a flounder. An olive flounder. Hey, Flatty Bobatty. Creepy fish that has both of its eyes on the same side of its body. Weird. Ooh, another big one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see it. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Eh, just another bass. A sea bass. Not you again. They're super, super common. I'm pretty sure we've already turned it into bladders as well. There's another little one over here. Let's see if we can catch you. Oh no! I didn't mean to like hit you with it. <sighs> there we go. You saw it. mackerel but it sounds fine to me see are you like a different kind of butterfly or something if I could ever find my net an emperor butterfly such a royal beauty so you're not a monarch you are a different type of butterfly that is super cool Oops. Catch one more and then we'll call it quits. And then I I will go hit rocks with a shovel until we find our money rock. Oh, 
I wish we could zoom out just a little tiny bit when we're here right at the ocean. Because it's so hard to see if there are fish here or not. Okay, there's one more. Come be caught, little fishy. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see it now, don't you? Here we go. Yay! Second horse mackerel. Woohoo. Barring anything cool or interesting on our way back. I think we're done here. It's just so calm and relaxing being out here at nighttime. I love it. Um. Probably need to take a few things to blathers. Oh, and we'll just, I'm gonna just dump the rest of our money, whatever we have right now, into our, uh, our mortgage payment. I'll do that after I get the money rock. So we'll be hopefully close to 30,000. Um, oh yeah, oh no, we'll definitely be over 30,000. We, we might cross the line just right now because of these. Don't think we've turned in you yet to blathers. I don't know if we've done a horse mackerel either. Thirteen thousand dollars. Holy crap! Uh, did we look at turnip prices today? I know I don't have the white turnips, but I'm just curious. Forty-seven bells. Okay. It's the stock market is collapsing. This has gone on for such a long time. Now you know what? I'm gonna go look for a money bell, and then I'm gonna go deposit the cash. Uh, we'll. Save these couple of things to give to Blathers in the morning. And who knows, I might be able to catch some other cool bug or something while I'm out here doing this. Uh, if I do, I will be sure to show it off tomorrow. So, thanks for watching, everyone. Hey, how are you guys? Isn't it past your bedtime? It is. So, thanks for watching, everyone. May the grace of the Twilight Dragon be with you.